Hello everyone, this is Optic Lock here with another action figure review, and here we have the Marvel Legends series, Disney Plus series, um, uh, Sylvie from the Loki uh, TV show on Disney Plus. Uh, so here is the front side with the Loki logo here, Marvel Sylvie. Here is the side art of Sylvie here. Here is the back here with that same artwork details here, and then here we will be building Watu, where he went over Zombie Captain America, where he went over to Chop Star Lord. And then there is also Captain Carter, Zombie Hunter Spidey, Superior Strange, Nebula, and Sylvie, which we're doing now. Here's the other side of the artwork. Here is the top with the Loki uh, logo furnished on top. And then here's the bottom. But besides that, let's crack, uh, crack her open. And here is Sylvie out of the package. So let's go over the accessories. So first we get Watu's cape here, which we'll go over once we build them. Throw them all the way back there. And then here we also got Sylvie's two uh, sword holding hands. So yeah, you get the fingerless gloves. Nice black gloves there. Uh, there's not much to really talk about there. Uh, so yeah, you get two of those. And then you get this blade here with this gold um, handle here with some nice detailing there. You can get some like gold green there. And then for the actual blade part, it's like a teal, which is really cool. I like that a lot. And then that's the sword for you. And then that's all we got for accessories. So here is Sylvie here. And here's the head sculpt. I think they did a really good job on the head sculpt for Sylvie. Uh, I will say that I think that she didn't look really this pasty in the show. Maybe if she, maybe if they gave uh, a little bit of a, like blush to it, that would be nice and help it out a little bit. Uh, I don't think her hair was this blonde either. Maybe add some like darker wash to it, but not too bad. The sculpt is really good. You get this. You also get this crown piece here with that broken horn here. Nice gold. And you get the blue eyes, and then you get that like partial ponytail up top here with all the other hair uh, laying down on top of the crown. And then what's cool here is actually you could take this off. So this is her like little robe. So yeah, you get this green hood, dark green here, and then the light green hood inside here. So yeah, that you get that's another accessory, but that just was with her. And then this is her without it here. So yeah, you get that like vest here with that gold detailing. It looks like it's worn down. You get some more gold in there. You get some like this really like military green or dark green here with some light green um detailing here and you get this like um pattering here on the lats and here's the back side here and then here's the sleeves and then for you get this like wide open hands for her to do like a spell um like that enchant people and then you get also a fisted hand for her. Here are the pants. You get this belt on her, but it's not like a separate piece. It's sculpted on there, actually. You get pinless joints for her, for the knees. And then you got the boots here with all those laces. So, yeah. And then let's go over the articulation for her. So, she has a double ball-jointed head, so she can look down that far, up that far, left and right. Lots of head pivoting in there. Shoulders can move out that far. 360 rotation there. Uh, she has single jointed elbows. I wish they did double jointed and then you can also swivel around there if you want Wrist can hinge down that far up that far 360 rotation You also got a ball joint at the diaphragm so she can go forward that much backwards that much side to side motion You can get some twisting in there legs kick it out that far forward that far backwards none thigh cut double jointed knees butt kick and then you also got a boot cut there. Ankles can hinge down that far, up that far. Nice ankle pivot. Also, for the sword holding hands, they actually have hinges that go side to side, actually. So yeah, that's Sylvie for you. I recommend you go get her because, uh, for one, she's going to be hard to find after. Uh, this wave is out for a while, and she's going to be expensive. So if you want her, go grab her when you can, and if you see her. But... I do like the figure. I just wish they did double jointed elbows for all female figures, but they don't. Um, 
like I said, that face sculpt is good. Like the actual sculpt is good. I just wish they did a little bit of a better job on the paint because she looks very pasty and the blonde hair is just, she didn't really, she had like a dirty blonde. It, this is like very blonde for her. Um, but yeah, besides that, that's really all I got for the figure for improvements that they could have done. Um, but yeah, really good figures still though. Um, but yeah, that's all I got for her. Make sure you guys check out my uh, link tree in my description. It has my TikTok, Twitch, Instagram, and Twitter. So make sure you guys check that out. But besides that, thanks for watching.